what would you call that uh, hairstyle you're wearing? Arthur. No, actually, we're just good friends. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the sub. I am here with my friend, Jordan. Hello! We're um, so, room. yeah, we're in Jordan's room. So, yeah, I moved places again. I do that pretty frequently. Today, I'm going to be asking her questions. You may recognize the questions from the Beetle Maniac tag because that's what I'm reading them from. That's them! Yeah! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> first question. When or how did you first hear the Beatles? I first heard the Beatles when I was, probably when I was little. Like, I'm pretty sure when I was little. <laughs> when or how did you start getting into the Beatles? Um, this summer, like summer 2016, I got into the Beatles like really a lot. Just because Bowie. Like, Bowie, Beatles, Queen was like my whole entire summer. Who is your favorite Beatle? George Harrison. Mm. Favorite. <laughs> the best Beatle. Yes. The best. He's, he's pretty good. <laughs> the best. <laughs> Do you play an instrument yourself? If so, what instrument? I play the ukulele a little bit. I'm starting to learn bass, and then I'm going to start playing guitar this summer. Hmm. Nice, nice. Favorite Beatles song at the moment? Michelle. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> I don't know how to respond, so I'm just like, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Favorite Beatles album at the moment? Uh, I like Rubber Soul. Yes. Uh, yeah, it's my one. Yes. I have my, I have my Rubber Soul blanket right here. Oh, wow. Good job. It's good. Yes. You covered the penguins. <sighs> They're good. They're peachy penguins. My mom's yelling for the dog. You can probably hear it. Do you remember the first Beatles song you heard? Um, I think it's Here Comes the Sun. I'm pretty sure it's Here Comes the Sun. Why did I mean, you say that? I mean, not only did I hear it when I was like little, just like from hearing it, but oh also God. the B movie. How much Beatles merchandise do you own? I would say I own like, I own two records just because I have the red album and the blue album, which is just kind of like a mix of like a lot. I have my Beatles blanket. I have like four shirts. Then I have the Legos. I probably have something else too, but I don't remember. How many Beatles albums do you own? Uh, I just said <laughs> the red album and the blue album. <laughs> Are you a mod rocker or mocker? Um, I don't listen to the Beatles that much as much as I did this summer, but I listen to a lot more like psychedelic rock, and I'd say I'm like more of like a rocker, I guess. But yeah, because I listen to, like the '60s like psychedelic rock. How's your Liverpool accent? I can't do a Liverpool accent, mate. <laughs> that sounds like Australian. That's not that bad. I can't do a Liverpool accent. Oh, it's getting there. It's getting there. It's getting there. Um, Ringo. <laughs> uh, I'm so sorry. Who is the most underestimated Beatle? George. In your opinion. George. I agree. His solo <laughs> work is so good. So good. Okay, thank you for that shout out oh, to I, George. Wait, Harrison. whoa, whoa, whoa. Back to the album things. I have a bunch of 45s. I have a bunch of Beatles 45s. I have two George Harrison 45s now. Well, like, of the same 45. Uh, do you think the Beatles cartoon should be brought back to ABC yes! on Saturday yes! morning? Please! I, that's, like, what I did kind of gotten into the Beatles, because I, I watched the Beatles cartoon 24-7. Like, one of our friends has the record holder, and it's, uh, the cartoon Beatles. He gave me, uh, what is it? Double fantasy. One and one and one is? Three. Correct. Can you name every Beatle and their birth dates right off the top no. of your head? George is like the 27th, I think, maybe. Uh, yeah, Ringo's is right in there. July. Uh, John's is in October. And Paul's, I don't know. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I'm I know, I know, um, February is George, um, October is John, and Ringo is July. I don't know Paul's. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just bad at remembering everything, so I have no clue. <laughs> what is the best thing about the Beatles? Um, personally, I think the music and George Harrison, Stop. and how they evolved. Like, I really like the psychedelic stuff. What would you do if you were a teenager in 1964 and got to meet the Beatles? What would everybody else do? Scream? No, I would not scream. I'd be like, nice to meet you. Thanks. Thanks. You gotta for, play like, it cool. Everything. You gotta, you gotta make yeah. them fall for you. You gotta. So like, I would not scream. Especially around George Harrison. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, Ringo was my favorite Beatle for a really long time. I think everybody starts out like with liking Ringo though, because they feel I... bad for him, kind of. <laughs> it's either you really like Paul first or you really like Ringo first. Yeah, yeah. I never liked Paul the best. The only, I'll admit, the only one that I ever like 
actually knew about. I only actually knew who John Lennon was. Mm -hmm. And then I started getting into the Beatles. I was like, oh yeah, Paul McCartney kind of sounds familiar. I don't really know who that is. I knew Paul McCartney and, George, and um, Ringo and John. I didn't really know George. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't know any of them except for John Lennon, yeah. really. <laughs> Have you seen every Beatles movie? Um, I haven't seen Magical Mystery Tour. And uh, I watched some of Help, but I never like, sat down and fully watched it. Have you seen Let It Be? Uh, clip of it. Yeah, so I, I can't it all find it. it anywhere. There's like clips of it. Yeah. I don't think there's the full thing anywhere. What about Eight Days a Week? Have you seen that? No, I haven't watched Eight Days a Week. Really? I don't know if you I should count it as a Beatles movie though, because it's not like really. Like, I mean, acting. yeah. I don't know. I counted it, but. Yeah, I mean, but they're like not really acting in it. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I don't know. Well, we should watch that. <laughs> <laughs> no, let's watch a Devin Boston movie. I'm editing that out. Rod. What modern bands do you like? Um, modern Baseball, TV Girl, I don't know who else I listen to. Pop. I mean, I've kind of, I've gotten back into that music sometimes, but I'm not really, like, into it, like, as much as I am on the, like, if I feel like listening to, like, modern music, it's gonna be, like, kind of, like, punk pop, kind of like that. Except TV Girl. TV Girl's, like, electronic. Who is the greatest band of all time? I don't say it's the Beatles. <laughs> I mean, I really, really like the Beatles, but I don't have a favorite band. Wait, I kind of like the Velvet Underground I vote a lot, but I wouldn't say they're my favorite band either, though. Who was the Walrus? Paul. I think it was Paul. I think it was Ringo. I think it was Ringo. <laughs> I have. Uh. I choose to be different. I just realized I never filmed an outro for this video, so uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um. If you did, make sure that you leave a comment, because I love reading your guys' comments. You guys are always so sweet and stuff. Um, so, yes, I will see you next week with another video. I hope you have a good rest of your week. Goodbye.